As students are experiencing right now, the university says it's been limiting class sizes inside lecture halls like this one, with 75% of classes being online, the other 25% in person. And so there's also been very little foot traffic out here throughout the day. I'm taking four classes this year. All of them are remote other than one, which is English. It's a hybrid. Five classes. Five classes. One in person and one that is hybrid. So I'm about half and half. Virtually everyone we spoke to on and off camera say they prefer in-person instruction, but their understanding of the pandemic-related precautions adhering to the policy set by the university. I'm starting graduate school by being like in this hybrid mode, and it's different, but all the professors and everybody's been really great about communicating what's going to be going on and stuff, so, you know, we're just going to do the best to make it work that we can. It is a little depriving, obviously. I mean, I'm about to start my first class, and I'm just, it's not even live. I'm just going to go up and watch a few videos, and that's going to be my first class, so that's going to be, it's going to be a little weird. I'm definitely happy just to be on campus, because I know a lot of schools are completely virtual, so especially freshman year, if a few of my classes are completely online, I think I'm fine with it, as long as I'm still getting, like, the great education. It's disappointing that we have to do everything remote, because we're paying so much for a university and we can't like use all the resources that it has but like for the circumstance and the situation that we're in right now it makes sense. I do wish the school would test students more. Um, I know Illinois is testing students and staff two times a week. Uh, I wish they did that more here. For the freshmen, this first year graduate student has some timeless pandemic proof advice. We don't know how long this is going to be so the sooner that you can get into a regular routine and you know get serious about what you're doing the better you're going to be. The university says testing, quarantining, isolation, maintaining distance, and as you've seen, wearing masks are a part of the new normal for campus life. In Ann Arbor, Darren Cunningham, 7 Action News.